Well, that horse dragging story we've been reporting on really has a lot of people fired up. Our viewers sounding off also about motor vehicle taxes and more. Here is tonight's Voice of the People. If he took the time to drag him and try to get him home that way, he's probably abused him in other ways. This man should be put in jail and the key should be thrown away. I thought it was inappropriate to show that. Uh, I really, uh, really thought that was off base. Uh, we certainly could have gotten an accurate picture from the, a description. Uh, I'm no longer going to watch your station. I think that it is very irresponsible of WTNH or any news station to display an accident that has just occurred during the news because of their eagerness to be first with the news. Anyone with a loved one watching would be very alarmed seeing those vehicles and if, if one of their loved ones is driving a similar vehicle. I do have a problem with them equalizing the motor vehicle tax throughout the state of Connecticut. Why should the rest of us have to pay more because we choose not to live in Waterbury, New Haven, or Bridgeport? There's no reason why we who live in the city should always have to split the bill. I do believe that the city and the town should pay the same par, um, rate for taxes. There's absolutely no excuse why it's different. Who's going to police all these pictures of these radar cameras, these cameras running uh, when you're running a red light? What happens when you slam your brakes on and get slammed in the pail end? What, what the insurance company is going to start saying about that? Feeling a little Monday out there tonight, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it sounds like it. Listen, if you got something you want to sound off on, you call our Voice of the People hotline at 203-212-WTNH. We'll air some of your messages weekdays right here at the end of the 530 newscast.